good morning everybody so today what we have we have a asus laptop which have some charging issue and it's not charging i'm, I'm sure there is some only the port uh, problem let me just turn on the light um, i'm pretty sure there is some uh, uh, the charging port issue so we'll just switch the charging port and we'll see how to replace the charging port uh yeah this is my new setting i hope you guys will like this and uh, let's begin the job okay so as usual i mean you have to be open the, on the back side first of all first you have to open this there are a bunch of screws already i just did that they kicked me out and you have to remove all this uh, screws so anyways i'm just want to just show you front of everybody so this should be good this is the hard drive Because we have to take out the screws, this is screw inside also, two screws here. Outside one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and eleven. And there's one more inside here. And uh, we have to take out the battery out. So the battery also, under the battery there are two more screws. One, two. So carefully. <laughs> And the, the more after this, you have to take out the CD ROM. After the CD ROM, there is there are more two <laughs> so, screws everywhere. Yes, but anyhow, after this, it's not finished yet, by the way. So you have to take it out the keyboard. Always use a sharp knock. So and try to hold it in. One lock is here, one lock is here for this power. And just right to just unlock this one. Let me just put the push on here. Power is out, this side is out. Now we can pull out this. Perfect, it's done. Now I'm going to show you my true camera. Right. Okay, so the side corner, as you see here, see, there is the power jack looks okay. But it's not working, just to see. Let me just take it off like this. Well, we have to open the whole the port. I don't want to open the whole motherboard, you know, just you know, I want to just take it out this one. This would be a jack over the bridge. Let's see here. Oh yeah, here you go. You know what, I think I'm just taking it off. Don't want to do anything with damage, you know, so there's maybe two more or three more screws. I'll take this one off. Let's take the jacks here. So careful, you don't do damage anything. I'm just taking something in the back. Um, okay, here you see, in the back, if you just see, there is a jack option here. Okay. 
this is much easier to be glued like this and then pick it out and there you go so this is the main part so something will be wrong it's not working so i'm gonna replace it i'll grab the new one and come back so wait Okay, so I have the new pin. Just want to make sure the the jack should be the similar and it should be good. Uh, just give me a second, just pull a second here. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we we'll just was there, sorry, there was a question up here, so. The jack, the main thing, you know, we're just gonna try, uh, just make sure it should be okay before we're gonna put it back on the motherboard and then. Okay, this must be. Nice, you know. <laughs> okay, so time to put it back and see the after this and charge it in. So what I'm going to do is we'll just uh, uh, put the front one because the suit is there and we'll just try to turn it on after this. Let me just put the charger in because we want it to be. Just plug in. Okay, let's see what will happen now. So, there you go. Start working. Good. There you go. We can see the screen now. So, there is, that was the clear issue. Okay, uh, so that was the procedure how to replace the, the charging port each time when you start a job you know there is always a solution for that because if there is a problem so there should be a solution for that if we just a little bit focus on it and just try to find it we will find the solution i hope uh, you guys can 
and guys like this video i hope you guys like this video uh please like it and share it yeah of course we will he help each other definitely it, it will encourage me to make some more videos take care of yourself have a wonderful day bye now